being a psychic, I mean, but he actually heard his own mom screaming. But he just chalked it up to illusion. He didn't even check to see. Right. And and watched. Um, he put his hands over his ears and yeah. go, not there, not, not there, there, not, not there. there, not there. Yes, absolutely. Yep. <laughs> and then, of course, you got uh, uh, Vic. He watched him die. I'm like, really? He didn't. He didn't even check. I mean, he doesn't. He just okay. He, he was too scared to go out there and try and help. Yeah, he thought it wasn't there again. So, uh, if oh. you ask me, I think when he got his fingers mangled, he deserved that. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, and no. You don't think so? Because you got to understand, he was probably just as scared as everybody else. I don't think he was accepting his ability. You think? Um, I don't think he believes in his abilities. There you go. Yes. And so he thought... They weren't going to save him. Yeah, yeah. If he used them. <coughs> Excuse me. So he hid behind the fear. Yeah, yeah. Until it was necessary, then he stepped up and used oh. them. Yeah, well. Yeah, in the end, he uh, kind of redeems himself. So, I don't know. <sighs> I, it was interesting. But they arrive at this house, and then by them coming there, all of a sudden, all these, it's the house, it's, you know, they wake it up, basically. And they start right. uh, learning the uh, mansion's deadly secrets. It's it's a excellent. I love this. I could watch this again and again. I really could. Oh, me too. I just, I, I love this one. Absolutely. Yeah. Freak and did, yeah. Yeah, the freaks always do it, Chris. Always, <laughs> little imps. Little. We gotta stop blaming everything on the freaks. It's, it's because we know who controls those freaks. No, it's the other way around. I think the freaks control him. Uh, okay. <laughs> he might be letting. He might be letting us believe that, though. <laughs> <laughs> And all this time, he's controlling them. Yeah, could be, could be, could be. <laughs> so. And, but in well, the end, um, yeah, Reardon gets, uh, she gets what she wants. She's part of it forever and ever. Yep, and she then Joyce, to stay yeah. there and. <laughs> okay, uh, we won't tell uh, don't always uh, watch what you wish for, because sometimes you might get it. Yeah, but then she and wanted to leave case, at the at the last second, though. She wanted to leave too late. You're stuck there with yep. us now. She's surrounded by the ghosts of Rose Red, Nick, Pam, Vic, and all of them. And she's like, "No." Yep. Yep. It's too late, lady. Yep. That's right. You wanted to be with us, and now you are. Yep, and then the, they watch them, the spirits and the ghosts of Ellen Rimbrauer, Sakina, and Joyce watch everybody leave after they pay their last respects. Yeah, they yep. really cause havoc in that place. But it's, it's, I think it was so well done. And you could believe Nancy Travis, who played Joyce, um, mm -hmm. that she was not all there. She was no. so obsessed with this place. Um that, I think she that, did a fabulous yes, job. She did. Absolutely. But so did They all did. They absolutely all did. Yes. They each of them had their own strengths and yes. they played up then they played oh, off yes. of it and it was just it was amazing. Yeah. It was just so well done. And another 
one of Stephen King's achievements is he actually wrote this for to specifically made into a to be made yes. into a miniseries. Yes. Yes. Yep. So you know, and I hear people all the time, well I well I have that book and it's like no, you don't have that book. No. There is no book called Red no. Red. No. I think they get it confused with that book that came out, The Diary of, of Ellen Rimbauer. Yeah. Yes. Which wasn't written by no. anybody in particular. A lot of people have said that Stephen King wrote that mm -hmm. under a pseudonym. I'm not really sure, to tell you the truth. Not that I know of. Not that I know of. Yeah, I didn't think so either. No, but he, but he did. He kind of did it for um, he on the basis of uh, Shirley Jackson's Haunting of Hill House because uh, yep. he thought it was one of the finest horror novels ever written. He absolutely loved it. So, again, like I said, it was kind of shades of Legend of Hell House, you know, same one. Yes. So, yeah. but it was well done. I really loved it. And to me, this and Kingdom Hospital, one of his most brilliant works. Kingdom Hospital was amazing. I had to get it I in there. It so, yeah, I had oh, to well, at least give it an honorable mention. We could, we, we could talk about Kingdom Hospital. Oh, no, no, that's okay. I could go on Another on. time? Yeah, we'll do that another time. That's fine. But that'll probably take up yeah. a lot of time. Yeah. Rose Red, I mean, Kingdom Hospital. Ugh. And to I, this, and Mary I really Bell. liked it a lot, but like I said, I haven't watched it in ages. Yeah, I have it. I have that and Rose Red. I, and I, you know, I Kingdom Hospital, I was sad, you know, when they didn't bring it back. I was. I thought, I loved the humor in it. You had Egg Begley yes. Jr. in there, you know. Yes. Um, I mean, the humor was good too. I really, I loved it. Right. And, you know, the whole, the whole thing. I, I really, really liked it. So, um, if you guys and get the it, fact that, and the fact that he, you know, wrote his his accident. Yeah. Into it. Yes. That was yes. Amazing yes. Me. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah. We could go um, on about that uh, again. So um, we're going to take a quick break. Um, I'll play some music from Rose Red. And uh, we're going to, when we come back, we're going to talk about Storm of the Century. Storm of the Century. Yes. And Andre Lanouge. Woohoo! Best miniseries ever made. Think so? Uh, I do. You think better than, um, better than Rose Red? I do. Huh. Okay. I uh, well, I have to put it up there with it for sure. At least a tie. Yeah. I don't know if it's any better. They're both excellent in their own right. That's a thing. Um, well, we'll talk more of that when we come back. We'll kind of compare them a little bit and and see what's what. But I, I loved them both. I actually did. Okay, here we go.